Y'all, I made it to Phoenix. <sighs> y'all, y'all just don't know what I went through today. But I just said I'm gonna go ahead and open this vlog and I'm probably gonna explain to y'all my flight situation tomorrow because it's 8.22 right now. And I just landed in Phoenix and I'm waiting to get my bags on my baggage plane. But yeah, I'm in Phoenix for my birthday, y'all. So we're gonna get around, right along with this vlog. I can't even talk, I'm so tired, but I'm not even trying to go lay down. I'm trying to go out and turn up because y'all, today has been a day. But again, like I said, we're in Phoenix for my birthday. My birthday is Sunday, today's Friday, April 30th, but I'm super excited. So yeah, y'all, y'all just stay tuned for the ride and we're just gonna enjoy Phoenix. That's it. Y'all, so I walked into the crib. Let me just show y'all my brother Eric set up. Uh, like, got the happy birthday, got the car. I ain't open the car yet because I don't want to cry. But we got the balloons. You know what I'm saying? We got the happy birthday banner. And I'll give y'all like a Airbnb tour tomorrow. 26, you know what I'm saying? We going up. You already know what's going on. But yeah, we lit y'all. We about to go out. It's about 11.21 right now. And it's probably like, it's MST, that's their time zone. So we're going to unpack a little bit and go out because we're at this restaurant, Trap House Barbecue, which I'm probably gonna talk about tomorrow. The waitress was telling us about. So we're going to go out to this bar tonight and I'll be checking with y'all tomorrow because yeah, but. What's up family? So I'm out here charging the car we got a tesla for the weekend so got about 25 more minutes remaining but y'all this made me fall in love with a tesla y'all like look at this like it tells you right there you just literally come and plug your car in and all that stuff currently right now it's 25 cent for how much battery i have absorbed but um yeah this is dope y'all but yeah just out here i got me some breakfast so i'm about to eat on that and just vibe and, and then I think by the time I get back, we should be ready to go to um, Horseshoe Bend. So I will check on y'all when we get there. Okay, so quick side piece. We pulled over to the side because we got this nice hotel or whatever it is that's abandoned. drive was long, wasn't it? Long as ever. It was a long drive, like four and a half hours. And we finally made it. Got my drone. Pictures. A couple pictures. We did make some piss stops and take pictures. That's how we why it felt long. We finally made it. Got my drone. We got our backpacks with water. Definitely need to make sure you bring that because in Arizona it's dry heat, so you won't feel yourself being dehydrated. But by the time you feel yourself dehydrated, you're about to pass out. So definitely keep one of those. But the lady at the gate. Um, did say that it's about a mile walk to the actual horseshoe bend. So we're about to do that now. And if I didn't mention, it is a ten dollar parking fee. So if you want to come here, we have to spend ten dollars But enough of all that. Let's go ahead and get into these videos. Y'all, this is. 
Y'all, it is beautiful out here, like, literally, like, I didn't even want to, like, I, I had to literally come out here and just sit for five minutes. I didn't even pull out my camera to just, like, record. Like, I had to take it in, and it is just beautiful. Like, we still out here walking. It's a whole, like, you can literally go all around and get whatever type of shot you want. So, but yeah, it is beautiful out here, y'all. Like, gorgeous. Highly recommend that y'all come out here. What's up, y'all? So today is my birthday. Today is May 2nd, 2021. So you already know we're going up. We're on the Casamigos, and Eric is on the Remy. So white and dark, Listen. but this will keep me up today. So I know Brown, and you know he on white. I'm on white, okay? And it's going up tonight. So I'm gonna take this shot with y'all and we're just gonna live it up, man. So 26. Let's go. Mm. Guys, it's on the beat. So that was Arizona, y'all. Like, that was my birthday. I literally had the best time of my life. Like, not even gonna lie. Like, just going to Arizona, going to the Grand Canyon, seeing the Horseshoe Bend, like, was just beautiful and peaceful. And it was what I needed to close out the 26th chapter, chapter of my life to move forward into the 26th chapter. Like, yeah, it was just fun. I was supposed to go skydiving on my actual birthday, but y'all, I feel like it was God telling me like, no, don't do it because one, the night before, I was like, I like, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Leading up to my birthday, I was like, I'm gonna go skydiving, I'm gonna go skydiving, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. So I, res I reserved my spot to, you know, go skydiving or whatever. And the night before, I was like really feeling anxious. I was like, oh my gosh, like, no, no, you about to jump out of a perfectly good airplane, 10,000 feet in the air, like, what are you thinking? But the thrill and just, you know, being able to go with the flow and expect the unexpected, like, that's what I wanted. I wanted something different for my birthday. So I get up on my birthday, I get up maybe around like, I wanna say like seven, eight o'clock because I had to go charge the Tesla. 
Uh, the place is about like an hour drive, and so I wanted to make sure I charge it so they can get there. And literally, as I'm charging the Tesla, the place where I reserved to go skydive and text me was like, hey, um, we have delay in our first jump due to the wind. Um, if you do plan to jump today, please call us so we can kind of let you know what our plan is. And so I called them and they were like, hey, we don't think today's a good day to jump because the wind is extremely um, strong and it's just not gonna be a good thing to jump. So at first I was kind of like, dang, like I went to go skydiving, but it didn't happen. And then after a while, I was like, you know what? We're in Arizona, we can make the best of it. You can always go skydiving um, anywhere. And so I was like, okay. So luckily I had already done some research before um, we went to Arizona, just kind of like looked at some brunch places or whatever. And that's how we ended up at Breakfast Bitch. And I'm not even gonna lie, Breakfast Bitch was lit. Like that was lit. Like, yeah, I didn't go skydiving, but that was probably one of the best brunches I've had in my life. Like bartenders were amazing the music was good the food was good people were buying me drinks up there right it was like it was literally like a bridal party in there it was everybody's birthday in there and it was just nothing but good energy and i'm just glad that i was able to celebrate my birthday and just celebrate this next chapter of life shout out to my brother eric he came on the trip with me as well and so we just really had a good time and did what needed to be done in arizona so yeah i want to close up the vlog here because i didn't really vlog as much um while i was in arizona because i was just having such a good time but i appreciate y'all for tuning in to this vlog and i look forward to sharing many more with y'all but if you haven't already make sure you hit that subscribe button and that bell notification so you can get notified when your boy do post the videos and yeah i'll see you next time family